Hello, well, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about uh, Soul Beast, and um, today's a very good day because I actually um, understand. I'm, I, how can I say this? Like, I'm actually discovering how to play Soul Beast like properly. Although I am no professional or anything yet, but I just discovered so many things. I'm like, holy shit! This is the build that I have. Some of you will, of course, debate on you know why do I pick this build. Um, basically, first of all, I have a longbow on my first uh, handset, uh, weapon set. Second, there is a, sh uh, is a broadsword. A greatsword, sorry. Where's, who's attacking me? You little tiny troll. Uh, basically, I use this build because I... How can I say this? I like, I love my longbow. So this is very uh, good for me. Quickness for 6 seconds, swiftness 12 seconds. Uh, and I like to also use number two, well, number four first and number two in order to, you know, to use my longbow as as, mu as much as I can. Uh, just like BM Hunter from World of Warcraft, so if you want to play like... Oh shit, one second. Who the fuck? Who the f... Where is he, son of a gun? Show yourself, you bitch. Who the fuck was it? Yo! Somebody just freaking... What? Okay, one second, guys. Th this is weird. This is weird. Okay, just like BM Hunter, uh, you know, like <laughs> this is how I. Th th the reason maybe why I like this build is because of BM Hunter. Because I used to play my BM Hunter. That's my main um, class in World of Warcraft, you know. And I so love, uh, you know, BM Hunter. Now you're gonna say, why am I taking this guy instead of this guy? Um. What I understand right now, what I'm learning, discovering, is the switching. When I uh, so when I switch to beast mode, it's almost like like a super mega buff, like where you go Geronimo for like 10 sec. Well, with this guy over here, uh, with concentration, you get like a freaking Geronimo boom shakalaka. You know, uh, it's all in or 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 all out technically. So basically, I take this guy over here, which go with this guy over here. Lesson Call of the Wild, because I get Fury, Might, Swiftness, Weaken, and, and, sh and Boom Shakalaka. But there's a 15 second cooldown, and, and it's also a combo finisher blast. Uh, this is during combat, or not? No, there's a, no, there's, it's not during combat. It's, you, there's a 15 second cooldown, so it's really like a Boom Shakalaka moment. You really want to use it properly. Uh, this is a 15 second cooldown as well. So whenever I switch, these goes hand in hand. So basically, does it say? No, it doesn't say. So anyway. Uh, this one as well, fresh reinforcement. So entering beast mode grants you the boons affecting your pet. So I'm gonna show you what happens when I when I um I could take this one, but I like this one for some reason. I don't know why. Because well, this is good for PvP, I get. But no, you know what? It's good for mobs as well. Because sometimes mobs they get on my nerves, you know. Like this one right now. Who's a fucking? Are you? Yo, really, man? I'm gonna kill everything right here on this map, like seriously. Is it him? Oh! One second. See all the buffs that I get? Look at the buff. This is fucked up. This is a boom shakalaka. Freaking boom shakalaka. And I can also use this guy over here, number 2, F2. Like this. And then F3. And then I, I keep boom shakalaka ing. Well, let me see. I have nothing. Okay, so yeah. Because I picked this guy instead of this guy. Hmm. But I prefer this guy, to be honest with you. Because I want a boom shakalaka. You know what I mean? So basically, it's really about sweet leaving beast mode, going in beast mode, leaving. So basically, you have a 10 second to boom shakalaka. But once you wait, once you, he's on cooldown, the good thing about this pet, um, he has this guy over here, uh, smoke assault. Take down these two spell over here. It's boom shakalaka. Basically, you do that again uh, against somebody or a mob or an enemy. It's boom shakalaka. So once your thing is back ready to go, boom shakalaka. I mean, if you're melee, you want to switch to melee, of course, and you want to boom shakalaka in beast mode, right? So they go back over here. But now there's no, there's not a lot of mobs uh, that is challenging. So I'm gonna maybe go here and see. So yeah, guys, I'm discovering a lot of shit. Now, the, the other thing, there's also the sigil. Uh, when you swap weapon, it's also an extra buff. So that's another thing that you have to consider. When it, whenever you swap this guy over here... One second, guys. Whenever you swap over here, you will get a buff. 
depending on the signals that you put on your weapon. So if I swap to sword while I have my, my buffs and everything, my boons, it's double boom shakalaka and I'm not even talking about my beast mode yet. So there's a lot of, and I'm not even talking about my utility yet. So I'm like super boom shakalaka, hello kitty motherfucking spank that ass, you know, shit. Like right now, look, look at that, look, look, look. Well, no, this is an easy guy, but I'm going to try this guy over here. Look at that. I'm going to throw my pet at him. I'm going to go like this guy. And this. And boom, shake it. One second. Boom, shake it. Oh, wow. Misclick. Sorry, guys. Switching. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. I, I kind of messed up everything. Okay, here we go. Uh, Well, it, yeah, I need, I need to have a... One second. I need to find something strong. You know what? I'm just going to do what I do, and you'll see what I mean. Okay, uh, who else wants some? This guy. There we go. There we go. And there we go. And you die. Leave your pet. Let your pet do your shit. Use number E. Switch the sword. Fly to him. Go in beast, beast mode right now. Like, well, right now. There you go. So that's pretty fun, guys. That's pretty fun. I like this shit. You know, like when I used to play BM Hunter, I was always I would always let my pet do the the entire shebang. But in Guild Wars 2, in Guild Wars 2, they kind of um, they kind of they kind of like uh, invite you to learn how to use a uh, like a melee weapon and also to use a longbow at the same time. So it it, it is way more complex. Than World of Warcraft, I'll be honest with you. you now I've been playing WoW for 16 years, and this is the entire shebang and, and spell switching and everything. It's way more complex than World of Warcraft, and uh, yeah, it's fun though. It's fun once you understand how it works, how to combine the best, how to combine the best thing over here. This goes hand in hand with this guy because when you disable with this guy, you get Fury plus you get 15% extra damage because see the this guy over here is a stun. And then there you go. Then you get 15% damage for the stun. You know what I mean? So you want to use Q and this guy right away, or even F2 right away. One of the two. Well, this one does more damage, to be honest with you. But this one, five times five, 2.5k, 2.6. Yeah, this one does more damage because it's five hits. So, uh, and it's AOE as well. Uh, number of hit range. Anything in, in, in the radius of 300. Okay. So anything that is like a 300 radius. So if there's like people over here everybody's gonna hit like I'm gonna hit five times whatever I need to hit but you want to make sure before you use F2 you want to have to get fury so you see get fury over here and boom shakalaka uh, you can also use this guy over here mm. you could use this guy for for short burst if you want I could try that uh, do I want I could try that because then this would but the thing is that your thing lasts it doesn't last as long but it does last but not as long as it should let me try that shit let me try that shit. Okay. Uh, first I need to uh let, let my pet do his shit. I could outrun All right. a centaur. All right, that's not gonna work. But I got my fury over here, as you can see. There you go. Like this. There you go. Yeah, he already died. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah, it is fucking powerful. It is fucking powerful. But the boon doesn't last. Well, it's okay. I mean, what is it? Eight seconds? All right. Time to do some real damage. All right. The other thing is mobility, maybe. So I'm gonna go use. I'm gonna fly to him. Switch strength, like this. Friend. F2. F3. F1. And that's it. Use my E. Uh, three. Leave my pet. Attacking, attacking. Oh, I got a fucking black lion chest. Thank you. Two, three, Q, two. Let's go. Switch to bow. Attack the shit out of him. Use this. I switch to uh, like this. F2. Sword. That's good. So I'm, I'm still practicing, guys. As you, oh, let's try on this guy. Let's see if I can. Oh shit! Wait, I'm gonna send my pet to him actually first, and I'll switch to my bow like this. There we 
go. Oh shit, yeah, this veteran. Alright. There you go. Okay. Oh, there you go. Not enough endurance. Nice. Nice. Oh, I killed him. Nice. That's good. And here you go. Are you guys seeing this shit? It's really about switching. It's really about switching uh, beast mode and leaving beast mode in the good. Like right now, see, I'm gonna attack him like this. Number two, and I'm gonna leave. Let my pet do his shit. See, he's gonna do his shit, and I go back to him. Boom. There we go. That's pretty cool. And the fucking chicken. Kill. Let's kill the chicken. Ba -ba! Also, Time use use here. F2 over here. Before you go to beast mode, if you want, you can use F2 in order to benefit of the uh, cloud smoke. Cloud smoke uh, blinds them, and if they blind, they cannot attack you. You know what I mean? Well, I mean, their attack misses. Yeah, so that's it, guys. Let me know what you guys think. You guys like the... If you, like, if you guys like this, this is like as close as beast mastery as it can be. But beast mastery with a great sword and a longbow. If you want, if you want, you can also just play with a longbow. I mean, you don't have to go uh, with the great sword. Look, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna use this guy over here. Do this. Where's my pet? The fuck? Where's my pet? Okay, there he is. Okay, go pet. Tag this guy. This gives you invisibility, by the way. This is a good thing. There we go. And by the way, this is not a tanky pet. This is like a medium mid pet. But this, is like the for me, is one of the best pet I have for a single individual target. Hey, go. Let's kill this guy here. There we go. See how fast they die. I'm gonna send my pet to this guy over here. It's pretty much like volley. See. There we go. There we go. See how beautiful that is? I love doing this shit. This reminds me so much of my BM Hunter. Come on, pet. There we go. Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think. I really enjoy doing this shit. I could do this for 24 hours and I wouldn't get bored because I just love farming. I love practicing my rotation. This is a good way to practice your uh, your class, your rotation, if you want to improve. I mean, without having to go into world v world PvP or anything. If you want to improve your skill, your switching, and everything. Whoops, shit. Very happy. This is as close as you can get to BM Hunter, but with it, like like I said, with a great sword. It's all about knowing when to switch. But in order to benefit from beast mode switching, you need to pick this guy over here, this guy over here, and this guy over here. And what else? Uh, you can take this one. You know what? I should have taken this one. What am I doing? I should have taken because when I see the thing is this guy. Whatever my pet like entering beast mode grants you the boons affecting your pet. So if my pet has like this guy here like uh, mites and shit, when he, look, I'm gonna show you. Okay, look at my pet. See, one thing I wish Anna could do is like we could I could leave the icon of my pet like around somewhere here, so I can see his boon because right now I can't. Because see, I, if I attack this guy, I cannot see his boon. His boon doesn't show up, and I need to click him in order to see his boon. So I'm going to show you what I mean. So I'm going to send my pet over there. So now I need to click my pet. See, he has boon. All these boon, when I go, I'm going to get these boon if I go into beast mode like this. Boom. So I get his boon. You see, I got 25 stack right now. It's fucked up. And when I burst with these two over here with the stacks that I already have, it's like boom shakalaka. Are you guys feeling my drift? Well, that's why it's a good thing to, you know. Uh, that That's why I guess it would be great if Anet could allow us to focus this guy and put like this I would right click this guy and then allow his uh, his you know his picture to be here or here whatever somewhere you know and or have the or have his boon to show up above so I know what boon he that would be great I don't see why not like to be honest with you I don't see why not because I need to know what boon he has because when I switch I need to know when to switch depending on what boons he have you know what I mean so I mean that would be very convenient I don't know if it's a lot of work to add those this little ui thing for the you know but that would be super mega great to be honest with you anyway guys let me know what you guys think and uh, thanks for watching please like and sub and i'll see you in my next bit cheers come on pet there we go
Switching. Woo! Love doing that shit. I love doing that shit. Fly to him. F3 and F1. You're dead. Going back to my bow in few seconds like this. Like this. Boom shakalaka. There we go. <laughs> Leaving beast mode. Sending my pet. Using my 5. Switch, switching back to my bow, uh, not my greatsword, number 2, beast mode. Oh, wait, beast mode. <laughs> yeah, that's it. And then uh, F2, there we go. And I missed my F2, that's wonderful. Now I'm going to use my ultimate here. I don't know why I did, but I'm just going to use it. There we go, there we go. Leaving my beast, going back to bow, switching here. Switch sick him, and here we go. Like this, there we go. Man, I'm having fun. You know, once you understand how it works, you're really starting to have fun. Like, like even when, yeah, yeah, it's <laughs> it's really fun to be honest with you. What the fuck? Something dropped? No, nothing dropped. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Cheers. <laughs>